Cambridge IGCSC Paper 6 Alternate to Practical February March 2023 Question number 1 This question is about cracking in which long chain alkanes can be broken down into shorter chain alkanes and gaseous alkenes Vapor from long chain alkane is passed over very hot catalyst and gases formed are collected over water the apparatus used is shown in this fig. Okay, what are the questions? Name the item of apparatus labeled A in fig 1.1. Look at this. This is a trough filled with water. B part. The catalyst is small pieces of aluminium oxide. Explain why several small pieces of aluminium oxide speed up the reaction more than one large piece of aluminium oxide because small pieces of aluminium oxide have more surface area or large piece of aluminium oxide has less surface area part c name the item of apparatus that can be used to heat the long chain alkane and catalyst the apparatus used for this purpose in laboratory is bunsen burner add two arrows to show where the apparatus should be heated well we have to heat the long chain alkane so one arrow is here and we also have to heat this aluminium oxide catalyst so second arrow you have to show at this point the gas collected is tested using aqueous bromine aqueous bromine is used to test alkenes when first few bubbles of gas collected are tested aqueous bromine does not change color explain why aqueous bromine does not change color Look at this diagram again. Before the alkene gas is produced, there is air inside this delivery tube. So once alkene gas is produced, it displaces the air present already in the delivery tube and first few bubbles of the gas that are collected over water are due to air and not alkene. E part, as soon as experiment is over and heating is stopped, the delivery tube must be removed from the water. Explain what happens if the delivery tube is not removed from the water. It will result in suck back and it breaks test tube. When the gas is heated, it expands and when you stop heating, it cools and contracts. It results in suck back of water to this delivery tube. Then this water may reach over this hot test tube and this test tube will break. So to avoid this, you have to remove the apparatus immediately after the heating is stopped.